Hello, my name is Gwyn, the company's security safety products, or as we're also known, SSP Direct. This morning I'd like to talk to you about security screws. I'd like to try to break it down, losing all of the technical jargon, and just talk to you about the benefits of security screws, when they should be used, and how they should be used. Most importantly, when it comes to selecting the right security screw, you need to ask yourself one question. At any point in time in the future, will I need to remove this security fixing? If the answer to that question is yes, then you'll need a two-way security screw. Now there are a number of different security screws that you can use. Um, SSP Direct do a number of products, including oval pan screws that are designed to look like rivets, tri-head screws that are specially designed for street furniture, and also we've introduced our brand new Kinmar bolt. However, this morning I'd like to talk to you about the three main security fixings. These are snake eye screws, also known as two hole screws or pig nose screws, um, pin hex screws, and finally pin torque security screws. First of all, I'd like to talk to you about snake eye screws. These are arguably the, the most common of, of all of the security fixings we do. This is primarily because if the novice knows any security fixings, it'll be a snake eye screw. Secondly, it's because of its aesthetic appeal. Of course, beauty is in the eye of the beholder, but certainly feedback from our customers seems to suggest that this is the best looking of all of the security fixings that we do. Where snake eye screws fall down is when they're required for applications where the screw is required to be tightened um, excessively. With a relatively low torque threshold, um, unfortunately the snake eye screw isn't always the best and it's in this instance that the user may want to consider some of the other security fixings that we do. Next we have pin hex security fixings. This range of screws has grown considerably in its popularity in recent years. This is because it has a far greater torque rating than the snake eye screws. It also has a far greater range in terms of different sizes and styles. So we obviously do the, the machine bolts, the self tappers, but we also do it as a raised countersunk for electrical socket boxes. Finally, we have pin torque security screws. This is arguably the, the best of the, the lot. Although there's little to choose between the torque rating of both the pin hex screw and the pin torque screw, under test conditions, with a six lobe configuration on the pin torques, this performs slightly better. It is for this reason that the pin torques range of screws is the screw of choice for the industry professional. A mixture of pin torques and pin hex machine screws are ideal for playground apparatus. One thing you may want to consider doing is combining two or three different security fixings. This is primarily because although there are a number of different sizes of, of driver inserts for any of our security fixings, sometimes the driver inserts or wrenches can find their way into the wrong hands. To prevent the opportunist theft, increasingly uh, companies like playground apparatus firms will, will use more than one security fixing on any given piece of apparatus. So for example, we've just sold one playground company, um, both pin hex and pin torques to be used on a roundabout. Next we have the five lobe security screw. This is very much seen as the next level up in security. This is a range of screws that are made to order. So when we receive an order, it usually takes us around about two weeks to produce these self tapping screws for you. Critically, it's seen as the next level up because of the control that we have over the driver insert. We'll never sell a driver insert for a five lobe security screw to anyone other than an existing customer. The only security fixing uh, that's more secure than a five lobe security screw is a screw that's made exclusively for you. Using SSP's patented head design, we can develop a screw that's never previously been sold to anyone else. We'll also register that the head design of that screw to ensure that no one in the future is able to buy a security screw like yours. Taking up to eight weeks to produce, these screws are invariably used for high value goods that are on display such as within a jeweller's or within a, a technology shop of some kind, whether they're selling mobile phones, tablets or computers. Going back to the question at the start of this video, um, sometimes people want to use a security fix in that they don't want to remove at a later date. In this instance, they'll be looking at one of our, our two one-way screws. The most common of these is the clutch head security screw. This can be simply affixed using a flat blade screwdriver. Clutch head self tapper gauge 8 or 10 are ideal for affixing number plates.
Alternatively, if you're looking to affix a number of security screws, um, then you might want to consider the Sentinel. Rather than using a flat blade screwdriver, you'd use a standard Phillips or cross head screwdriver to, to affix the Sentinel. This means if you're using an electric screwdriver or drill, you can affix a number of these screws uh, without any real delay, in the same way that you might have with a clutch head screw. It's for this reason that the Sentinel screw um, is growing in popularity over and above the clutch head screw. That takes us on to security nuts. Much like security screws, security nuts come in two varieties. The permanent one-way nuts and the two-way removable security nuts. The most common of these is the shear nut. Shear nuts are available in three different material types. Galvanised steel, A2 stainless steel and BZP. They are attached using a standard wrench or spanner. When the nut gets to a certain level of tightness, the, the hex at the top of the shear nut will simply break away, leaving a cylindrical dome that cannot be removed using a standard tool at a later date. Similar to snake eye screws, the only downside of the shear nut is the level of torque that this screw can be tightened to. Shear nuts are frequently used for palisade fencing. The alternative to a shear nut, if you're looking for, for a nut that can be tightened to whatever level, uh, then you really should be considering the, the Kinmar permanent one-way nut. Using the socket provided, this can be tightened as required. SSP's patented Kinmar security nut is also available in a two-way version. Kinmar removable nuts have been used to affix bike racks to the top of vehicles. Much like the driver inserts for the five load pins, the socket that, that's designed for the Kinmar will only ever be sold to customers of Kinmar nuts. We'll never sell it on its own. Yeah. Finally, on security nuts, we've got the scroll nuts. It's been around for a number of years, but it still remains very popular. Very much like the Kinmar tool, we'll never sell the, the socket that affixes and removes the scroll nut to anyone other than existing customers. This means the chance of an opportunist theft of anything that's affixed using a scroll nut or a kin mark is greatly reduced. Finally, can I just thank you ever so much for taking time out today to watch this video. I genuinely hope it's been of some use. Uh, if you have any queries relating to security screws, um, security safety products have been selling security fixings for well over a decade now. If you've got any queries of any technical nature, please ring us on 0844 997 0101 or we can be emailed at sales at securitysafetyproducts.co.uk. Thank you.